ya, go. Bien. Vamos, vamos, torre. Exactly. Repeat. You're going to your right, so you have to repeat direction. Very good. Now. Hello, welcome everybody. Today we are here with Fede Vives in one of the most beautiful clubs in the world, I think. Real Club Tennis Barcelona. We're going to do the first volley and tactics to improve specifically on the first volley after the serve, where to serve, and some extra pro tips from Fede Vives. So stay tuned. Vamos. <laughs> how are you? Oh, good, how are you? Oh, good, where thank where you. are we? We are in Real Club Tennis Barcelona. Your Welcome club. Welcome to my club. It looks really nice. This might be one of the most successful clubs in uh, tennis history. Yeah, is it? It's house yeah. of big tennis players from Spain. This is Rafa Nadal club, for example, Arantxa Sanchez Vicario, Carlos Moya, world number one player. So I'm really happy you're here. Yeah. And I show you. All the club right now. Yeah, and okay. we have to say it's it's eight o'clock in the morning. Uh, we had no breakfast yet. No breakfast? No. Yeah, we're gonna breakfast. Oh, anymore. okay. <laughs> First, we're gonna do a nice video, so stay tuned. Vamos. Godo. Godo is our ATP tournament oh. winners. So here you can find. I see Rafa Nadal a lot. There's any. 17, 18. There's any Holland player? Yeah, Richard Krajicek. Yeah, 94. Richard Krajicek. Yeah. Richard Krajicek. The trophy of Godo was created for. For a member of Tennis Barcelona, Rafa Nadal have. He has, he has two because every five times you win, you can take it. So he has two in his academy. Wow. I think he's been playing here since he was 12 years old or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> and everybody plays domino here. Yeah, it's typical. Okay. Dom domici. Domici. Domino. 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 Oh. <laughs> History of. All presidents of Real Club Tennis Barcelona. For the room. <laughs> yeah, it's when you when you sing the big contracts. <laughs> yeah. You forgot the room. Panic. <laughs> That's really nice. Vamos, vamos. And we also have an indoor core. So they can go and train with good conditions. No weather. Yeah. No raining. Perfect. It's not raining inside. No, it's not oh, that's a good inside. indoor location. It's uh, proper so. indoor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there, there's a lot of light coming in. Can you do something about that? Yeah, of course. Don't worry. We have yeah. a sensor here. If there's light or wind. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's screen much goes better. down. Night is coming. No rain, no wind, no sun. Perfect. The okay. first folly after the surf. Perfect. Introduce. My student Alvaro Godorro. Hi. Thank you, Alvaro, for help us today. So let's warm up some. Yeah. Punta arriba. Bien de patas, Alvaro. Vale, cambios, Ben, you bully. Muy bien. Venga, último, Alvaro. Oh, hostia. Punto. What a point, Alvaro. <laughs> We're going to start with tactic first bully. When we serve, we have different options to serve, right? Yeah. So, side wall, center to the Alvaro's body, yeah. or T1. So what we're gonna see is, depends how he return, where he have to play the first volley, okay? Yeah. We're gonna start serving to the side wall, yeah. okay? So if and I have a backhand volley, I, I volley to the corner? Depends, let's see now. Okay. I, I wanna see where you volley first, okay. and then we talk about it. Okay, perfect. Okay, Alvaro, you only, Alvaro is gonna return a soft ball to your feet in the center one. Which option do you think you have? Where you will volley, which velocity? Slow. Slow? Yeah, slow to, uh, to the to middle. To the center? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. You will try to play a deeper ball or kind of shorter around the line? Okay. Where, where you will use to volley? Shorter or longer? Shorter. Perfect, why? Because if I volley deep, uh, the ball has a big rebound. Exactly. So first of all, we're going to try this volley. Yeah. Softer return, soft volley. So you can maintain Alvaro 
close to the back wall so he cannot attack you. Yeah. Or lob comfortable, okay? Yeah. So that's our first option. Let's go, let's try it. Okay. Vamos. Exactly, little rebound. One more time. Too deep? Yeah, too deep. Let's try to play around the line. It was good because you played with little slice, so you maintain the ball deeper. That's good. That's Ben. Otra vez. Have you seen? There's a lot of rebounds, so he opened your angle because usually he runs to the center, so he can get you the angle with, yeah. with a chiquita. Yeah. So you must think after the first volley, if I was your partner, He's moving to the center, so what it's very difficult for him is play me down the line, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the center to help you. So <coughs> yeah, one step to your left to get the control to don't be allowed him to yeah. get the defense. One more time, let's go. Good one, okay. Is it good? Is it good? You still make it bounce, but let's try with volley. Un poco más larga, Álvaro. Perfect one. Yeah, that's the perfect one. Now my serve was better. Yeah. You, you, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You take more of the control because, because I, it was I, deeper. I, yeah. And he has to go back, right? So yep. he cannot get into the ball and Be make something with you. Yeah. So now I have more. I could do two steps more. Yeah. So that was the difference between hitting here and, here and there. Here or a little higher. Yeah, it's perfect because yeah. it was a deeper serve. Yeah. Good one. No much velocity? No, you see? no, I wanted to, I, I thought, let's do slower and deeper. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly, because you have more time to take the net. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to find another volley. Okay. So you're going to take the ball a little higher. Yeah. We're going to make Alvaro make steps. So now what I want is you attack little volley to the center, okay, with your forehand too. The slice, the same, shorter, please, because what I don't want, it rebounds to Alvaro. I don't want yeah. Alvaro can... Yeah. Can go with a chiquita, yeah. can go with a lob. So I still want you maintain the control and he has to play you to take again another volley, okay? Yeah. Un retour a little higher, okay? So we, he will attack you to the center. Let's go. Deeper one. Good one, Sven. Yeah. Here, you take a little higher, yeah. put more velocity. He has to run to the center of the court, yeah. right? So you take more angles yeah. for the next volley. So if you, if you have a high contact point, you can accelerate with the volley. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You make very good because you put little yeah. slice, you put the racket higher for the ball. That was yeah. the perfect And if one. the ball is lower, you have to accept the fact you cannot attack. Yeah, exactly. So you play slower. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. To maintain him at the end. Repeat one more time. So now he will open you the angle, play the lob, you yeah. have the fence, or again the cross court. Okay? Yeah. Let's try again. You're serving a little short. Oh, one return, Alvaro. So he's cutting your time. So more effect, deeper. That was deeper. Yeah, that was deeper, a little deeper. <laughs> All these two volleys you find in your right, not close to your body, little outside to your body. So you have to play the lower one, just lower to the center, higher one you can attack. Yeah. Now Alvaro is gonna return more to your body. Yeah. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, as you don't will feel comfortable to play in the center, we're gonna take one step to the left and we're gonna attack down the line. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's when I start attacking down the line, it's when I feel I have the ball inside me so I can take space and accelerate. Oh, okay. That's when I start attacking yeah. my opponent in front of me. Yeah. And you take little center, okay? Because he's not gonna play against you. So you have to take the the center to defend, okay? Let's go. Good one. Good one, Sven. Thanks. See? Yeah, I understand. And he's please. in trouble because he find he find the ball or deeper or side ball, but he's going back. So he has to defend. So you still maintain the attack, okay? Yeah. Alvaro is smart and he's re returning faster. Yeah. Yeah. So it's difficult to change angle. Uh, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. But when you find in Better velocity, start attacking. Yeah. Don't forget to follow me. I mean, move to your left. And if I was your partner, I will take the center. Yeah. He used to, if your attack is good, he used to defend or play another lower ball, not, not lower as a chiquita, 
so you can maintain attacking the net. One more time, let's go. Yep. Whoa. It's a bit risky. <laughs> but you have good hands, it's very good one. <laughs> if you are 15 all, take less risk. If you are winning 40 0, I mean, you can take, you can be risky, right? Yeah. So also important what you decide, yeah, depends of the score. What the score is. Yeah. Let's go one more time. Ooh. A little far away, one step up. Let's go. Super. Yeah. Super one. Okay. And don't forget to continue, eh? Follow the ball, eh? Yeah. Okay? That's good. To improve this, you know, Sven has good level, but I will split with my students. First of all, without movement, you know, I want his short where directions are. So we will start with one basket playing outside to repeat, playing little center to play in the center, playing lower or playing against his body to take the space. Yes, this is, I mean, for people who start to learn, for beginners, easy, without movement. Then we will do with little steps, you know, from center to volley. And when you have the control, we will do the, the big exercise serving. Okay, you want to try? Yeah. Let's do it. All your body balance outside, you will repeat the direction, okay? Because you can take, go inside the ball with more energy. Second one, we've been practicing lower one. You have to play a lower ball to the cone. Third one, higher one, so you can attack more in the center. And the last ball you will find is to your body, so you will take space and you will accelerate down the line to your opening, okay? Exactly, repeat. You're going to your right, so you have to repeat direction. Very good. Now you play softball to the center. Little slice if you can, Alvaro. Perfect, one, you maintain the opponent back. Two, very good wall. One more time, lower. Perfect, Alvaro, it's okay. Now, higher one, same, so you attack to the center. Yeah, and Alvaro, go inside the ball, eh? Yeah, and good slice. One more time. Perfect. Three. And the last option, little to his body, so you take space to your left and you have to attack on the line. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, and one. Take space. Two, very one, recover the center. Take space. Three. Yeah, and Alvaro. See? Yeah. So it depends on the direction ball is coming and where you are positioning, I play. I'm going to my left, I repeat, so I still maintain the center. Lower one, as we talked before, we maintain the opening back. You, will, you can, what you will do if you take the center? Or you will make me a lob, or you will make me yeah. play this angle because you are running to your right, right? Yeah. So higher one, I attack slicing, getting a space, I attack down the line to my opponent. Yeah. That's good. He feel the, the options without moving, yeah. Now we're going to do the same with moving, with little moving. So Alvaro, you will start from, yeah, from here. So I want the split step and you repeat. So now we're going to do the same exercise, but coordinating with movement. Okay. Two of every, each one. Let's go outside first. Split, repeat. Good one. Split, Alvaro. Repeat. One more time. Go inside. Bien. Vale, now lower one. So Alvaro, run, 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 run. And lower, perfect. One more time. Lower. One more time. Let's go, Álvaro. Bien. Atrás, porque lo quiero con movimiento. Ahora, go in. Perfect. Go back, Álvaro. Venga, go in. Venga, go back, Álvaro. Go in. Vamos, one more time. Go back, go in. Bien. And now, body one. Álvaro, ya. Bien, one. Go back, Álvaro. Go in. Go back, Álvaro. Go in. One more time. Go in, Alvaro. Split. Perfect. See? So that will be a progression. Yeah. Not for you, not for Alvaro, because, you know, he can serve and do it. Yeah, but, but still, it's good to do it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, of course. To remember, to feel comfortable. Yeah. To remember every step. So now, the final progression will be the same, but from serving. Yeah. Okay, so serve, split, outside of me and repeat. Lower center, higher. Yeah. And if you don't know what's coming. 
Yeah, but you have to think before serve. I always say you have to get kind of tactic, because if I find a ball like that, I can imagine. I can imagine which is my next ball, so I have little control of the point. Of course, if he returns different, yeah. But I have one order. So if the ball I feel and I find this ball, I have the order. Yeah. I know what it's. I'm going to do. Yeah. Yeah. So it's it's not a surprise. No. And it's important to have a uh, patterns, tactics. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So now we will going to do the same, but what we gonna do if we find the return in our backhand? Okay. See? Yeah. Let's go. Vamos. So we're gonna find different returns to your backhand volley. The top one is center volley. Now you will find the ball little to your left, not too much, little. So why won't you play a ball before the baseline and to the center? Okay? And I'm gonna see what you understand for center, Alvaro, because here there's people who confuse this. Okay. Okay? Venga, three balls in a row. Let's go, Alvaro. One, two, three, one more, Alvaro. Vale. Alvaro, if you want to play to the center, you won't make your opponent move. I mean, if Sven run to the middle, you will get the corner, right? This is a typical mistake. Many people volley here, following the line. Can you give me one ball? If I will make you run, and you play me in the rear center, ball is coming to you. Yeah. Yes, right? So you have to do less steps. So when we say volley to the center, we have to make the volley die in the center. So we're not volley following the, the center line. We volley, we, we volley cross, but we volley in our own side, because here, is where the ball dies, so you still have to do more steps. Yeah. So this is a typical mistake I see a lot with my students. They think play in the center is play in the middle. No, no, if you want to make steps, don't ball it here, because the angle, ball is coming to you. So play, cross down the line, making sure the balls die in the middle. One more time, please. Before baseline, aquí, vamos, little high. Here, one more time. No, venga, Alvaro, otra vez. Perfect. Make the ball dice. This one. One more time. Last one. Esta es la buena. Yeah. Because uh, now I have to run more. Exactly. Yeah. So you have, he has more time for the next volley, for so the next So if attack. people play paddle too fast, they are never going to get this right. Because the, the precision on this is so important. Exactly. Yeah. Let's going to find a ball against his body. Yeah. Okay, not to his, not open space to his left. So now, Alvaro, the only chance you have is repeat direction. If you have to repeat direction, what I recommend you is try to play against his feet, right? Because here you have no control, you have no time to think much. So yeah. now you try to play a deeper ball against the basket or against the spam. Okay, let's go. One more time, Alvaro. Bien, this one. This one is Ben to defend. He has to go back. He's not comfortable. Because if you play this ball, but not again as Ben with the space, with the rebounds, as Ben can decide what to do. Here you don't have give chance. Yeah? Because he's going back, ball is, is, is on him. A good one. A slower one to his feet. Alvaro, center, remember, not the line. Give me some space. Make the ball die in the center. Venga. Good one. Bien, Alvaro. Bien. Here I can attack you. Very good. A little higher, so I want you to attack the fence. Go, 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 go. Very good one. Go, go, go. Very good one. Bien, esta. Esta, esta, esta. This one. Alvaro. More, more, more. Take more. This one. Nice. One more time. Walk inside, perfect one, good one. And the final one, when we play down the line here. When, when he has to move to the fence. Exactly, so imagine you're playing an angle. Why? Because after his volley, he's moving to our right. Yeah. He will be in the good position. So now, Alvaro, stay in the middle. Sven is going to play you a ball in the angle. So you have to play 
Straight. Exactly. Now Alvaro, after the volley, is in the good position. Yeah. So he cannot attack. He has to play a smart tactic. One more yeah. time. Alvaro is far away from you. One more time. A little far. Alvaro, ponte un poco más aquí. Que la encuentres lejos. Ahora. Exactly. So if I play straight, Alvaro is in good positioning. Bien, Alvaro. Also, when you play straight, he plays slide with a slide, right? It's much more easy for him to continue attacking because the ball yeah. dies. So I can def defend comfortable. Yeah. yeah so, so you have to understand, even though you're not at the, at the net, uh, you cannot always attack. No. You cannot always attack. Yeah. yeah. People used to think that attack, attack, attack to win. Yeah. You have to const construct yeah. the point. Yeah. yeah. It's not only attack. Yeah. Good defense sometimes is the better attack. Yeah. See? Okay, so now we will do the progressions and then serving. Bien. Good one, Sven. Yeah? Good one. So you maintain me here in the back. I have to play a lower ball. I will play a lower ball to you. I have no much space to make a good lob. Yeah. So I will play you an angle and you can take depends of how my return is, you can play the fence, or you get yeah. again the cross court one to maintain the control. Yeah. Very good. I think a tennis player wants to play a forehand volley, prefers a forehand volley to accelerate, mm -hmm. and a paddle player wants to play the backhand volley because then he can make uh, an angle. That's true. But you think like a paddle player. Yeah, but uh, that's good. Yeah, I, that's I think good. so. The yeah. tennis player used to think I have to destroy the ball. Yeah. You know, that's why they take the forehand. <laughs> yeah. Left on the right is the other way around, of course. Yeah, exactly. Let's go. Exactly. So I will play you the angle. Yeah, but I can move. Yeah, yeah. you can move and your partner follow you. Yeah. Oh, you killed Vamos. me. <laughs> I thought you served me here. Good one. Yeah. Good one. Play some straight now to attack if I play against your forehand. Good one, sir. Good one, Sven. We're going to serve to the T? Serve to the T, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Expecting the T. Oh, I only had coffee. Okay. <laughs> Good one. One more time. So second option for me is play, is play to the center. But in that case, it's not your ball. It's your partner ball. Oh, okay. Because everybody moves to my, to my right, right? I wish. Venga. I'll try to play to the center. You will see you cannot take it. Yeah. Okay. You. So exactly. Where is your partner? He left. He went to work. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Vale? And now, if I move to the center and you want to make me volley cross, I yeah, can and back deep, side ball. you will not play me a side ball. Because side ball, ball against, come to me. So let's try to find the back wall. Yeah. Yeah, to make me run more distance again. Let's go. So don't play cross. Cross, ball comes to me if I'll start running to the fan. Yeah. Yeah, so you won't make me more steps. Exactly. So this is long distance. Yeah. Yeah? See? So you have to think or you have to take order if you can decide and you have the precision where to play the first volley. Yeah. To start yeah, getting the control of the point. Just to, to control, lower one, you play to the target cone. Okay, so you serve me to the T, I return your low. One, venga. Two, venga, one step up. Very good. Now, same one, you serve me to the tee, but you find the ball a little higher so you can accelerate more to the fence. Bien, uno. Recover. Two, one more time. Bien, one more time. Step, get in. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Now, a little far away from you, so you play straight. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bien. 
Good work, Sven, don't stop. Recover the center, go. Bien, Sven, very good one. Okay, now you imagine you find close to your body, higher one, so you make me run to my corner again, so don't play. Let's make the mistake first. Play side wall, okay? Yep. So ball will comes to me. Yeah, so this is the typical mistake. Not this one. Look, if I'll return the serve on the tee and I'll find the ball here, yeah. it's pretty easy for me. Yeah. Right, so try to find deeper but back wall. Let's go. Oh, extra one points. Time. Yeah, one more time, Ben. Venga. Don't wait for the ball, go inside. That's good one. One more time, go inside. Venga. Last one. No, wait. Yeah. Bien. Yeah. See? Good one. And now, with some steps, okay? Yeah. And then we serve. Turn. Footwork, footwork, footwork. Yeah, turn. Let's go. Lower one. Good one. Yeah, go. Bien. Vamos, vamos. Turn, turn. Yeah. Bien. One more time. Go. Bravo, Sven. You're tactically a yeah. good student. So here you can find a lot of combinations. Yeah, and to learn to make a decision. Exactly. Yeah. Because it's, it's, it's good to have clearly the tactic. Yeah. But sometimes, as you said, it's not like that. Yeah. So you have to react fast. Yeah. So exercise like that, with the simple exercise, helps you yeah, to, to, to find the real situations. Yeah. See? Yeah. Thank you everyone for watching. If you want to see more videos like this or want to see more videos with Fede, then uh, let us know in the comments below and uh, see you next Monday. Hasta luego. Ciao. Adios. Today we are in Barcelona Real Club de Polo. Very nice, very nice club. And we have the Legends Pro Arm Tournament. Uh, we're going to play some matches today uh, with some World Paddle Tour players and also with some legends, especially from football. So you see here Francesco Totti. So on the Monday, we played uh, like the mixed in. So we played around, you play with somebody else, you play against somebody else and you switch around and you play. It's like the official tournament, so now only the, the former football pros play uh, and they are going to decide who's the best player. And um, you can see it in the players, they really want to win this trophy.
we are on day two of the Legends Trophy. All the teams are divided into pools and now we're going to decide who's going to be on top of the pool. And then we continue the, uh, tomorrow uh, and we're going to have lunch soon. But it's raining a little bit. So what you do is, if it's raining, play to the side wall. So now we have our Dutch guys, Kees and Doris, are playing. So the, the only Dutch people that are here to, today. So hey, vamos Holanda. So the Legends uh, Tournament is a yearly event. A lot of Palo Courts here, I think 20 Palo Courts. And a lot of famous football players playing here, ex-football players. And I can say they can play proper Palo, they, play the, they, they really play the game of Palo. So uh, there are a lot of big names here that you can see in the video. And I think they play a lot. Het lijkt een beetje op Björn Borg, of niet? Eh, uh, Joel. 